So today let me show you how to upgrade your G Pro Superlight 2 from 2K to 4K polling to give you that extra competitive edge. So I'm Billy Bob, been gaming 35 years easily now, went into gaming tech and I give you the latest updates on mice as well as modifications and reviews on tech, sometimes stream some games as well. If you like that kind of stuff and you'll get that edge over your rivals, this is the channel to tune into. So let me show you what you need to do first. So first we're going to need to download the Logitech G Hub. If you haven't got that already, most of you will have it. Then you're going to need to install it once we've got that. Just follow through the usual install paths. You'll need G Hub, the older software, which was Logitech. Mind you, if something doesn't work, it has to be Logitech G Hub. Say no thanks. And then skip at the top right. Then you'll be given this option now turn on your G Pro Super if you're not already using it. And then you'll be asked down the bottom right here to install and the latest firmware. Click install, make sure you've got enough battery, obviously. Give you a load of um, updates, things like new update available, add support for 4K polling rate, and you also receive it, add support for 4K polling rate. So what we have to do now is connect the G Pro Superlight 2 with the supplied USB cable as well. You can't do it off that. And if you're using the power play or not, we need the USB receiver as well. So let's get the provided USB cable. Should be included in your box that came with it. Don't know if you can use any USB-C cable. Normally you can, sometimes a little bit funny. Some provide different voltages. Plug in the old G Pro Superlight 2, and then you'll get this all green now, and then click install. Don't unplug it during this process, you'll see it doesn't work. You will destroy it if you unplug it halfway through the firmware. No power cuts, just make sure you leave it fully plugged in. Don't you to think. Once it's complete, you'll get firmware updates successful. You'll also now get your mouse back to working, which is good news. Just no powers piling up there. You see some features, skip those. And then now when you go to your polling settings, where they are, DPI down here at the bottom on the default settings, you get wireless polling rate. You can now see, close this down. We now have 4K. Wild polling rate is still on at 1K. You would have thought, why did you get 4K? But you don't, it has to be in wireless. Now you get 4K. Then you can check that as well using like a poll tester. If you just type this into Google, you get loads of them here. You can use like, um, this clicks per second one's not bad. CPS, gives you an idea if it's working or not. Click to start and then now you can get your polling rate. You're still only seeing a thousand, you see, about 900-ish. That's because it's wired, take it off wired. I mean, I should see a much higher polling rate as you do. It's only showing 2K, but it will go up. It depends what you're playing. There you have it, how to upgrade your Superlight 2 to the new 4K polling to give you that extra edge. Just bear in mind, it does take a little bit more CPU. So if you're starting to see a lot of lagging or spiking, it's probably because the polling rate's high and you might have to turn it down if your CPU is not capable of that. If you've enjoyed this, catch you later. See you on the next video. Peace.